now it's a prison, but I want to stop. Keanu Reeves became addicted to a horrible habit after falling in love with Cameron Diaz in a $3 million film. Actors have done it all, locking themselves in a room for utter seclusion, not washing for weeks or even months at a time, developing a fairly dangerous smoking habit for some roles, and threatening others on sight. These types of method acting have long been the preferred method for some of Hollywood's most gifted actors. However, traveling down this path can be risky at times because it can have long-term consequences for the mind and body. Taking up a pure art house project requires a lot of dedication, and most of the time the directors pursue the artists to take some extreme measures to prepare for their role. Dealing with enough tragedies already throughout his life, even Keanu Reeves could not avoid a certain habit while shooting for a film back in 96. The John Wick actor's reputation precedes him, big time. What became Keanu Reeves' prison habit? The Matrix star's on-screen attitude is diametrically opposed to his off-screen personality. Everyone is aware of his true nice guy persona, as he prefers to live a very humble and low-profile existence. However, the roles he picks are typically dark and difficult. Feeling Minnesota, one of his older films he worked on with Cameron Diaz back in 1996, had the actor hooked on puffing cigarettes back-to-back. -back. The film's premise followed a love story between Keanu Reeves' Jax Clayton and his older brother's woman Freddie Clayton. On the sets of the film, Reeves picked up a nasty smoking habit, which in an interview with the Daily Mail, he shared, I didn't even start until I was 30. I got hooked making Feeling Minnesota and now it's a prison, but I want to stop. It didn't take the 58-year-old actor long to leave the life-threatening habit and get back in shape. Keanu Reeves' humility has become his legacy. During press junkets and public appearances, Keanu Reeves shines his own light on the public as the man is extremely kind and polite with people, even the ones others don't look at. But his smile and humility conceal some of the most traumatic events in his life. Losing a father when he was three, having a nomadic existence, changing schools, never receiving a diploma, losing his best buddy River Phoenix to a drug overdose, losing his child, losing his child's mother Jennifer Syme, and helping out his sister with leukemia, pick your poison. Even after all of this, Reeves has managed to live a lovely and humble life, taking the train and even allowing wage cuts to keep the projects continuing.